Hey everyone, this is JB Third Video, and it's that Mega Shawn. Dun 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 dun. And let's take a look at the box. Decepticon logo back there, kind of weird, but that Mega Shawn for you. And he like, where's my burritos? Where? 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 And this side. Transformers and the rest of him. I'm not gonna say all that because that don't make no sense to me. It's just there for confusion. Transformers and Cybertron Raiden. Yay! I love those. And big picture of Megatron. And he is um a destruction of planet Earth. Everyone knows that, of course. And tech specs. Pretty nice, pretty mega shiny. Says the says so there. Has hand already got him with Cybertron writing. Anything in this box is bad for you. Don't eat. Mean it. And that cool shit mode. And 22 steps. Almost the same amount as hound. Oh my. Oh my. Can we handle one more? Okay. Bottom of it is a scan box, and everyone understands that. An Autobot symbol. And more Cybertron right in there. But nothing else. Change to Transformer! I had to do that. Pretty nice shit mode. I like that golden red mix there in the cockpit. I like that golden engine look here. It looks more a shit like in Cybertron's. For Megatron at least. Megatron always had bad taste for some reason. <laughs> Except in a gun form in the very first cartoon. And his big wig mode in Dark of a Moon. That was pretty neat. And pretty much you see stuff under there, but I'm sure I for you that. Pretty nice. And if you're wondering what that, that little uh, slot there is, it's for his crazy looking short. My mom thought it's a uh, part like axe and part sword, but I told her it's just a sword for Megatron. Megatron always had bad taste, and it fits. It has a peg here to go in that slot, and I'm trying to get focused there because it's so hard to focus. Because it is especially around this time. Pardon me. And nice swing span. Like those golden slot type colors going down the wings. Pretty nice. And he looks like Megatron pretty much. Except his face. His face even scarier than any face I saw in a Megatron anyway. So let's get to transformation. First, lift that, and that. See that slot here? Goes into that slot peg here, and here. And, move these out. They don't peg to anything, for some reason, but I don't mind that. It does work for me. And, go under here, and peg that, and peg that. A little peg, a little post here and here a peg slot and um let's see here um I know I have to move these sideways like this and lift that up then get the foot out Ooh, the foot is hard it's so hard oh I broke my back <laughs> And flip the wing blade down, and ta-da, there a leg. We have one leg done, and same on, same on to the other leg. Other leg is same transformation, of course, because he like keeping it simple. Because unlike Starscream, he think a little bit easier, a lot, lot better as Starscream would. And pretty much flip these down. Bring that up. Turn these around. 
Oh, forgot a mission. You have to get that down after you flip these up. Like, after they like this, you have to flip them like that. And that had to be against this. And this had to plug into here. Forgot to mention that. Sorry. My bad. I've been I'm really tired lately. <laughs> and do the same thing on this side. And this side. And flip those out because those you have to actually have flipped out. And we have to bend this back to get to the box. Ugh. Mine a little bit stiff. Don't know why, but I guess mine says want to be stiff to me. And forgot to mention it has a peg here and a peg slot here. And that gonna slide right in here. Like so. And you have to unplug like this from here after you get them separated then I work on the head first because the cannon noise goes later um, flip this down turn the head around and flip this out flip the cannon down flip his hands out and uh, we have Megatron. And hey, I need to take a drink. <laughs> okay. His sword could plug here or here, but sometimes I plug it in his hands, but mostly I plug it back here for storage let's take a look at his bendability okay let's look at the head first mostly because the head I want to start with the head before I go anywhere else nice paint up here too bad not light piping too bad for that that golden mustard look orange too bad these don't come down but I don't mind because they creepy if they down and he has evil red eyes. Like in the cartoons and movies. Ah. And his head go up and down. Like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me a burrito. Give me a burrito. And go this way. Pretty much goes 360 all around. And does that much up and down. Let's take a look at his arm. His arms could go 360. 360. And his arms, these could come up, and his arms go about 90, a bit of, over 90 degrees. They're over 90 degrees. And, um, bicep swivel. Yeah, 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 yeah. And bends over, way over 90 degrees. Like, he want to pound himself on the shoulder. And his wrist don't do no moving. This goes in and out for transformation. And his leg could go, if I lift this up, goes about that far and that back. It's stiff. It's really stiff. And it goes that far out. And that pretty much it. Has hip swivel. Take a short off because it's in a way. And it spins about at 90 degrees. And a foot could do this and tilt. And that pretty much it on Megashon. And if you're wondering if I say who better, I'm just gonna say they all good. For their parts they do best. They're what they're good at. Megatron, he good to show destroying things. That way he does. And Awesomeness, I don't have him yet, but he good saving worlds by worlds. And the Bumblebee, he good being a scout and a warrior and very top best, he is the second in command. Voila. Alright, 
watched a glimpse on YouTube of Optimus and Bumblebee facing the evil, uh, whatever she is. A Cybertron God dog, gonna call her. And Optimus got frozen in her beam. He, like, met my, meet my little flan, and Bumblebee came around the corner and blasted her in the back, and she falling down, like, Whee! Whoops. Sorry, Megatron. My bad. No one's seen that. Okay, onward. And then Bumblebee came around the corner after he did that. He said, I sting like a bee. And that would be fun shit i seen. Because I haven't went to a theater or anything to see it. Because theaters, this one theater I really like going to. Because the only place I could go to. Because the only theater I know where I am. It cheated on me. It took the Transformer movie out before I even see it. Unfair. Very unfair. Very naughty. But boohoo. Sister movie. I could see in, in the winter area. In Christmas time. I'm fine with that. And. He pretty cool. He pretty unique. Mostly scary. But cool. And that pretty much it. As Imgo say it. And you guys should watch Imgo a lot more. I have and. He pretty, he pretty funny, pretty cool, kind of like me. I'm strange, and I am crazy, kind of weird, but I'm a good kind of crazy. I make people laugh for fun, and that's pretty much it. As M go say it, palm in your face. Okay. S Star scream, sound wave. For everyone! Where's... What is this? It's ticked at my back. Oh, oh, what is it? What is it? Ah! First sound wave. What, Sean? What, Mega Sean? Hell! No, Mega Sean. I'm busy. Oh, I gotta fire you.